And this video is sponsored by Step. Today, I'm going to meet my biological father. Last time I tried to do this, this happened. I knew it wasn't going to work. I just want to go home. But today, it's actually going to happen. Hey. some gifts. As you can tell, I'm in Georgia. We got a lot of stuff happening today, but I want to explain to you how you can win what I'm giving away. In multiple videos, I have given away like a thousand dollars, an iPhone, tons of other things, but today I'm going to the Apple store to get something very special. How are you going to afford something from the Apple? I didn't bring my credit card. Well, you're in luck because today I have my step card to help us. Do you ever get tired of being like, hey, yo, mom, hey, yo, dad, hand over your credit card? Nope, because I have the step card. It's virtual banking for teens and young adults. And the step card is great because there's no overdraft fees or random charges. That's right, guys. With step, you get an FDIC insured account that is completely safe with absolutely zero fees. None, <laughs> zilch, zero. Zero. It's amazing. I highly recommend. It's so cool because it's customizable. You can get it in three different colors, pink, blue, and yellow. I got mine in yellow. Can I borrow your step card? Uh, Frank, you can actually use the link in my description to get the Step app and you will get $10 into your bank account. It literally only takes five minutes. And the best part is that I get to start building my credit at such a young age. Let's just go to the Apple store and let's get a super awesome gift for one of the viewers in for the For you comments. guys, let's go figure out what we're gonna do. No, we're not getting anything for you, Frank. You're a bad boy. Frank, why don't you just go get a step card? All right, let's go. I have a ton of things that I can give you guys. I have an Apple Watch or like an iPad, another iPhone, or maybe I could give you guys some new AirPods. I like the AirPods. I like the AirPods, the AirPods too. Let's do it. All right, purchase acquired, and you guys need to stay to the end to see how to win this amazing gift. Now let's get to the point of this video. Today, I'm going to be meeting my biological father. But if you guys remember last time, it didn't go so well. I just want to go home and just see everyone and see Lip. <laughs> okay. All right. So last time we were supposed to meet, he didn't show up. But a few days ago, I got this phone call. All right. Are you ready for this? Uh, yeah. Are you ready, little man? Is this actually happening this time, or are we just going to waste our time again? Uh, I don't know. We'll see. Let's go tell Piper. Okay. What are you guys doing? Why are you filming? Because. I actually need to talk to you alone. On camera, there's very few times that we dig deep into your personal life. But today, we have something pretty big, and I, I feel like... Don't. Like, I usually know what's happening, but right now I don't know what's happening. Yeah, so... Well, I got a phone call from someone today. It's, um, actually, you're, you know, I don't know what you want to call him, your biological dad, I don't... Whatever you want to call him. Um, and he, apparently, he's really sorry for what happened. And he wants to meet you when we go home for the holidays. Really? Do you want to, um, do you want to call him and I talk mean, to him or? That's fine. You sure? Mm -hmm. You yeah. sure? Yes! Yeah, that's, yeah, that's fine. Okay. All right, here goes nothing. <sighs> Deep breath in. It's okay, just, just call him, just call him. Just call him. Sure, sure. It's um, I have Piper here. She says that she's oh, willing hey. to talk to you. I'm gonna I'm gonna give her the phone, okay? All right. Yeah. Cool. Um. Uh, hi. Hey, Piper. How are you? I'm doing okay. I was calling to see if uh, you might be coming home to uh, Georgia for the holidays. Uh, I am. Yeah, I'm coming to Georgia for the holidays for Christmas. That's so cool. So when are you going to be there? Um, I'm going, I'm leaving like this Tuesday. Leaving Tuesday. All right, cool. Yeah, I was, I was calling to see if, uh, you know, maybe you wanted to meet up in person. I mean, that, you know, well, that was my expectations for, you know, um, last time I wanted to meet you, but it was like a little like difficult and you didn't really show up. Yeah, li listen, I had some I had some things with work that I had to do, you know, that uh, it, it well, took I mean, me away. You could have told us yeah. that, but 
Yeah, listen, listen, I, I, I want to see you and I, I want to meet up with you when you're in Georgia. You know, it's it's been too long and I just want to see you. I'll, um, I think I'll think about it. I, I'm, I mean, I don't really know what to say at this point. Yeah, listen, listen, baby, I'm sorry. And oh, I, I don't, I don't think you should call her baby. That was a little weird. Like, you don't even know her. Yeah, I haven't so, seen you, like, my yeah, whole, like... Let's, come on, she's 14 years old, you haven't seen her since she was four months old, don't... Let's not do the baby talk. It's a little weird. But, um, I'll... She'll think about it, and I'll... I'll text you back, okay? Yeah, just text me, and then, you know, <laughs> let's connect, yeah. Okay, I will text you, okay. Okay, just hang up the okay, phone. bye. Oh my god, that was so weird. Hugs. Hugs. That was very brave. Hugs. That was Hugs. very brave. You think about it, you let me know, okay? okay. Piper, talk to her dad, oh my god! That was weird. <laughs> yeah, it was weird. But just because he called me doesn't mean I want to meet him, so I asked my friends what I should do. Okay, guys. What happened? Um, last night my mom got a call from a very unexpected person, um, my dad. Oh my god. Oh. Um, he wants to hang out with me and try it again. I mean, yeah, obviously I we're gonna support you, but Based on what happened last time, I don't want you to get hurt again. That's he explained what I that said, he was but busy. He said that he was like he had better, like he had other stuff to do. Yeah, but that's yeah, just an busyness, excuse. Busyness is never an excuse. To see your own daughter. Personally, from my right. from my experience, okay, I've never talked. I've talked to my dad once. I've never seen him. I wish just once that I could have seen him. Because it's not even like I'm gonna be nice to him. I'm probably gonna tell him like how. You know, well, hasn't been the best at it. But again, from my personal experience, I would just say give him another chance. And again, you don't have to have a friendship with him or anything like that. But so maybe, maybe you should. Okay. Well, we're gonna support you whenever you decide, babes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. So now that we're here in Georgia, it's time to meet my dad. It's Christmas! Merry Christmas! I hope you guys are having a great Christmas so far. But today is a very nerve-wracking day where I'm going to have to meet my biological father. I'm very, 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 very nervous. He literally said he's gonna be here in an hour! So I have an hour to get prepared mentally and physically! What, you gonna, phys you gonna work out or something? I don't know. No, I'm literally gonna wear these pajamas because I am not trying to make a good impression. I mean, remember last time it was a terrible impression. I really hope meeting my father today doesn't ruin Christmas because, you know, it could possibly ruin Christmas the way you know he does or Christmas stuff could and be I great. Just, like or it could be great and I could reunite with my father but everything's obviously not gonna be perfect let's get into it I'm actually gonna get my family's opinion about it because I don't even know if they know yet and this is probably a little dramatic for them as well so yeah literally he's gonna be driving down your own driveway soon and talking to you and hanging out with you so who knows how this but is gonna be. The bright side it's actually not cold today which is so amazing all right let's go talk to your family and then Talk to your dad. If he shows up. Family. Oh, you're always worse than this. Amelia! <laughs> so I have something to tell you. You got your period. No! My dad. Ew. <laughs> called me while I was in LA like a few days before I came here and wanted to hang out. And. I hope he said no. It's not like I'm gonna like have fun with him. I just really wanna like, cause the last time I was supposed to meet him, you know, they like, he didn't show up and stuff like that and he apologized so. Are you sure it's a good idea? Well, I mean, I think it's a good idea. I don't know if he's gonna like, I mean, he wanted to do this, so if he comes here and he's mean to me, then it's like. He's coming here? Yeah. Oof. Does he hold me back? <laughs> I mean, I don't have to let him in and see you guys. I can like literally just do it out there. I think it's a good idea. I do too. Get it out of your system, meet him, see what he's all about, and Close that chapter of your life. Yeah, good idea. Keep your head straight. Don't let him hurt you. I don't know like yeah, where you are mentally. Have to hurt him. Yeah. Alright, well, I'm good that I got your guys' opinion. So we're gonna go wait outside. He's gonna be here in like 20 minutes. So. Oh god! Let's do this! So he was supposed to be here any minute, and he is not here yet. He's like five minutes late, which is making me really nervous because I'm like traumatized from the last time that he didn't show up. Uh, you know, I'm nervous and I just want this to happen and I mean, I, I really don't know I hear know a car do. coming and it's just going the other direction. Ah! Yo, yo, my check about 20 minutes later. Sit down, don't be 
a hater. It's been like 10 more minutes. Okay, like, he's 20 minutes late. Come on. My family is like concerned. I'm concerned. And I'm literally waiting right here to see because we have kind of a long like driveway. So like maybe, I don't know. Do you think I, do you think I should just like stop Look, making To be honest myself? with you, it's Christmas. Look stupid. It's Christmas day. Your actual family's sitting inside waiting for you. I say let's just go celebrate Christmas. I don't think I pop, like I don't think I can. Fiber, don't let this ruin your day. It's just, it's fine. It's not fine though. You know that it's not fine. You know that this okay, isn't right of him. But and let's be honest. The problem did you is, not... is that he invited me to do this. But and, like, you it wasn't my idea. You had to expect this. Like, come on, let's be honest. I didn't expect this. I thought he was gonna actually do what I said. I mean. So I, I guess he's not coming. So. Okay, so it's a roller coaster of a morning because this morning we woke up kind of early and it's Christmas Day. Also, what a great Christmas present for Piper's dad to actually meet Piper. But he's not freaking here. And like we talked to Piper's whole family about this. We sat everyone down at breakfast and now we've been postponing Christmas to like celebrate Christmas because of this. And this is what we get. So, I don't know what else to say except for I'm disappointed. And yeah, sorry for the letdown. Okay, so it's been over an hour, and um, we're gonna start playing some Christmas games and stuff. Hey, so Piper's dad, Casey, right? Yeah, yeah, are you, are you filming this right now, or? Um, yeah, we... Hey, do you mind I'd if film. I'm not on camera, is that cool? Was well, it's just, we film everything, it's, it's just a camera, like I'm not gonna do anything with it weird, it's just a camera. I so. just I'm not really comfortable being on camera, I haven't seen Piper in a long time. Yeah, well, uh, like, I mean, okay, so with Piper we document everything, like in her life, like we film everything, she's like a YouTuber, so we, we put everything on camera in her life. Can you, can you blur me well, out? Or yeah, yeah, no, I'll blur you, I'll blur you out your face and like whatever, but like, um, we've been waiting for an hour, so like if you, you know, if you're gonna leave that would be really messed up, so like. I'll blur your face. All right, no, no, no. I'll protect you. I'll, like, I, we won't even film your face. Like, I can film your feet or something. Yeah, can you just, yeah, can you just film my feet? Yeah, I yeah. I really don't want to be on camera. No, I understand. It's you just, know? you know, you kind of blew Piper off, and she's been really upset about this. It's... Well, I was afraid something like this, you know, I got... No, it's okay. Like, we'll protect really you. We'll blur your Piper face. I does, but, you know... You're good. I don't want to be on camera. Yeah, just, just, like, she's been waiting for over an hour. So. All right. Yeah, here, come on. I'll go get her. Come on up. Hey, Pipes. What? <laughs> He's here. You showed up? Yeah. Like your dad is standing right outside the front door. He was so late again. Yeah, it's, he's an hour late, but to, let's be honest here, you're kind of late to everything. So. Now we know where you get it. My, no, she gets it from me. <laughs> okay, look. But he's here, so just take a deep breath. I'm nervous. I'm really and, nervous. Um, I'm really nervous. No, you're gonna come with me. Come on. You want me to come with you? Yes. Why wouldn't you come with me? This is a, you. Okay. Okay. But before. look, this is weird. Okay. Just okay, take a minute. You have to come just with take me. a minute, and I'll be outside. You don't want. No, I need you. Okay. 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 I'm gonna make sure he doesn't leave. So just. Okay. Okay. She's coming. She just. She needs a minute. Um. Because she's nervous. Yeah. So me too. Just, Hey. Hi. Come on. Long time no see, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh. How are you? I'm okay. How are you? Oh, yeah, pretty good, pretty good, yeah. Okay, well, this is a little awkward. Yeah. yeah. Especially because, of, like, you know, the last time that this happened and stuff, so. Well, he's actually here now. So yeah, that's I'm not here now. Yeah. <laughs> that's why I seem more awkward. Um, <laughs> you want to sit down and talk? Yeah, let's like let's talk. Let's get to know about each other. We have some questions we can ask. And okay, yeah, just as long as no, I got camera. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, think we should. I think we should keep it like kind of short though. Like okay. 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 Yeah. So yeah. here, why don't you take a seat and let's. All right. Yep. Yeah. Um. Okay. Well. Uh, did you want to ask him some questions? Yeah, <laughs> I'm getting to that. Uh, last time we were supposed to meet, I had some, like, questions for you. Okay. 
Okay, there's obviously a lot of tension built up, but I'll help a little bit. Anyways, um, okay, let's well, start with some fun questions. All right, fun question. So I would like to know how you uh, met my mom. <laughs> Tiffany, yeah. Well, we uh, we started out as friends, and uh, we worked at a, a vet clinic together. We all had a lot of mutual friends together, and uh, the longer we worked together, it uh, kind of evolved. I, I know uh, Desi, too. We were good friends as well. Okay, that's a good first question. Um, next question is, what were you like when you were like my age? Like, I'm 14 now. Yeah, when I was your age, I was uh, just starting to get into music. Yeah, I've heard that you like used to have a band and stuff. And yeah, you, like, yeah dreamed about going on tour and stuff and you know I I wanted to tell you last time that like I'm going on tour and stuff but really yeah um, yeah she has like a bunch of songs I met like a lot of new people and you know I'm going on one next year which is gonna be really really fun I'm going to like, how long does the uh, tour last like how many cities are you playing in? I mean I don't think we have to like really get into all of that because it's not like you're gonna like be there or anything but oh no no I was just curious something you know I always wanted to do so I feel, I feel like I kind of like, you know, I did, I feel like if you were in my life, you know, I would make you proud. I don't, I don't know. But, um, have you heard any of my songs? Like, have you ever checked up on me to see if, like, what I'm doing lately? Uh, to, I mean, to be honest, no. No, I haven't. You're, you're going on tour, so obviously you're doing well. Yeah, I'm doing well, but. A lot of people like your music? Yeah. I guess. I mean, some people think it's like cringy or whatever, but she's know. underselling herself. Okay, she's a rock star. This girl toured the whole United States, and and people love her. She's had sold out shows, and I mean, from what I've heard, you know, you you would have loved that. But she she killed it. And she definitely gets the wanting to be on stage from you, but like also at the same time, like no offense, people actually want to like see her. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Low <laughs> yeah. blow. So, next question, uh, why, like, now did you decide to, like, reach out? Like, well, I, I don't know if you know this, I don't know what your mom told you, but I grew up uh, with divorced parents. My parents were separated, and so I basically saw each parent, you know, I took turns on the weekends, and honestly, I didn't want that for you. I wanted you to have the full experience with your mom and not to divide your attention to divide your attention between us and honestly i was focused on my music you know it's a tough business you know yeah, this i don't think i'm like ever gonna like truly understand but like i mean i know where you're coming from but i thank you for thinking of me because i don't think i would have liked that either like it probably wouldn't have been fun for me so thank you okay well i mean it's christmas and yeah but i mean i think i have one last question to ask you which is like the most important um <laughs> did you ever like love me yeah i mean listen i want you to do your thing and i don't want to be a part of your life to interfere with what you have going on. Does that make sense? Listen, I didn't, I, I never wanted a kid, but, but you are in my heart. I care about you enough to stay away because I don't think I'd be a good dad. And I don't want to interfere with your life. I mean, I think just like growing up and then you've always like, I don't know. I just, I guess it's, I'm glad that I finally met you, I guess. Uh, but I, it's Christmas and I kind of just, I want to like, not like stop talking about it because. Okay, well, here. I'm, I'm glad that you met him too because, you know, I always felt like, you know, maybe like, oh, she's like walking. Look, he's here. It's a big deal. I know. I, I, I mean, I it's not like a, like, woo, let's throw a party in my dad's home. Like, that's not how it's gonna be I mean like I understand like he might be upset I mean the 14 years that he hasn't seen me it's hurt me way more than what I'm saying to him so okay I'm really glad that she met him because like I always felt like she was just hearing my side of the story you know but like now she can actually like 
but no, that's fair. And I appreciate like the honesty. You know, I appreciate him being honest and everything. So, but it's Christmas, so oh yeah, let's let's brighten the spirits up. Thank you for coming, and um, yeah, yeah, yeah just. No, I, I'm cropping your face out, I promise, right. privacy. But uh, let's go celebrate Christmas, huh? Fist bump? Yeah, fist bump. All right, all right, Christmas, Christmas let's go. Well, I appreciate you coming. Um, I'm sorry for all the camera stuff. That's just kind of Piper's life now. Um, yeah, I get it, I get it, you know? But uh, uh, yeah, just please, man, don't show my face. Girl. I understand. Yeah. And I think you'd be real proud of her. She's, she's honestly a rock star, so. Yeah, sounds Thank like you. it. Yeah. Thank you for coming. Yeah. Bye. Yeah, we'll see you Tiffany. Bye. So, if you want to win these AirPods, all you have to do is turn on my post notifications and comment something nice about your family. And one lucky winner will take home these brand new AirPod Pros. And thank you, Step, for sponsoring this video. And that was meeting my dad. Today was a very eventful day. I got a lot done, and I think that this, you know, honestly, really helped me in a good way because I think there's a lot of girls and boys out there with, you know, no father figure in their life. And I think that it's a good thing to, you know, get some closure in that area. So I feel a little good about it. I think it was the right thing to do. And I'm so happy that I had my family there supporting me. I love you guys so much. Thank you for always supporting me. You're the best. And if you didn't have a good day today, I hope this cheered your day up. I love you so much. And I hope to see you in the next one. 